My name is Xavier, and welcome back to the invasion. Look at this paused screenshot I have managed to find here. We have a dropping enemy rover coming right through. Look at the flames coming in here, looking uh, or heating up our wind tunnels. Make sure to crash to be sure, but in any event, I'm not really sure what's happening here. It, uh, I know what's happening here. I started an episode, so there's gotta be a talk show host doing talk. Let's go free Earth, I feel like. I feel like today is going to be a good day for a free Earth. We'll see. It could also be the end of the colony. I don't know what these things do. Let's find out right now. Boom! This guy just landed in there. What's he doing? Uh-oh. Far as I can tell. Uh-oh. What's he doing? What's he doing? What's he doing? What's he doing? Don't crush my little rovers! What are you doing? No! Guys, evasive maneuvers! Okay, they don't, they don't crush each other, so that's good. Um... I gotta say, I'm worried about this. I don't really know. This is supposed to be some kind of military prototype. I'm not sure at all what's happening. Oh, what did he just do? He just sat there for a second, now he's driving over here. All right, let's go check out what this pipe is. Okay, that we're fine over there. You got a cold wave in three days. I'm really worried about this. Where are you going? What the? He's not even doing anything. He's just driving around in circles. <clears throat> okay. Well, that's a bit anticlimactic. I think we get some more of these guys around here in various places. I thought there was one landing over here, but I can't see it. No, it's over there, maybe? Is that the same one I was just looking at? I don't know. Either way, uh, we're nearly done with scanning here as well. We got one, two more, and then we're done. Anything down here? Nope, not that I can see. Let's make sure this guy is covering. He's not. Let's move him back up there so we get uh, coverage and all that. It's not that it really matters. That thing's not running right now anyway. We're up to zero water. Producing 10, water demand 9.8. I just built a new one here. Let's upgrade that so we have a little bit of a surplus. That's my biggest concern, actually, is running out of water. Because I don't have any more moisture evaporators and I can't make them until this rocket lands. But uh, let's just keep going. Things look fine enough to me. How's this moisture evaporator doing for maintenance? Looks like it's at 54. Sector scan. I really want to confirm for sure when this thing does its zappy here. Which doesn't seem to be anytime soon. This guy's still at 9% over here. Yes, he is. All right, well, uh, yeah, okay. I got all super scared and now... Apparently I'm fine. By the way, my uh, RC Explorer crashed out there. Oh, here comes a guy driving by. Maybe Sector I could just go scan. grab one of these drones with a little bit of battery. No, you actually can't fill them with batteries, I don't think. Because this thing's no longer functional, I suppose I can take this rover and go rescue him. Sure, makes sense to me. That thing was taken care of. Drones with no controller won. Oh. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that guy. How is he still alive, actually? That's pretty interesting that he's still out there. Maybe I can go pick Please him up I with my thing if I remember. Fire. Well, rockets. You know what I mean. Oh, okay. I, w I was worried that, like, there were rockets incoming, but they're giving us a little bit of time here to build our defensive turrets. I've just queued the research. I've just finished it. I'm already 9% done the next one, apparently. We can now build laser-targeting missile defense systems. This will help us mount a defense against the incoming attacks. This ought to give us a fighting edge. Beautiful. All right, Mars Wars, guys. It's time for Mars Wars. Where the heck is this? Defensive turret. It only... Wow. Five electronics, ten metals. Luckily, I've got a... Bi well, I don't actually don't have a billion electronics. I do have a lot of electronics, so... Uh, but it also takes maintenance. Protect nearby buildings from... Me Wait. Defensive turret. They, that also works against meteors? Can attack enemy vehicles at extreme range. Oh. So I was wondering what the difference is between that, the defensive turret mysteries, and this here, the meteor defense system. Destroys falling meteors in its range. This seems to be just a more precise version, an upgraded version, I guess. It can also shoot vehicles. So what we need to do then is probably get this guy set up in here to defend. How much do I need to do for this? Let's see. Power consumption 10. Press RT rotate. Does that does the does the direction matter? It looks like it can swivel. 
I, I would think. I'm not really sure. So where are they going to come from is my question. Let's put one over here in the middle of the base. Cover up pretty much everything over there. Or, yeah, because I think we're going to need three of these guys. So this will cover everything over there. Perfect. So that's one. I think we're going to need another one. How far down did that one go? It didn't quite cover the... I don't think we really need to cover every single thing perfectly. But if we can get pretty close to that, that would be good. Here would be actually awesome. Can we grab that one recharge station and destroy it, please? It's going to take a little bit of a while here to get that thing. Okay, nice. It's out. Boom. Get rid of it. Awesome. Defensive turret. Come on, guys. Get it in. Okay, this is taking way too long. Okay, drone just got in there. Awesome. I'm just going to do something like that. I'm not sure if it really matters. Now, as far as overlap, looks good. Something like right here would be perfectly sufficient. We'd cover all of our dome in every direction as far as I can see. All the dome over there. Beautiful. Okay, that's going to be three of those guys. I could put another one down here, but uh, I suppose maybe it would make sense just to defend too far from working drone. We'll bring one over. I'm not really sure if I need one, though, but I'm going to do it anyway because I don't want meteors falling on those tunnels. Those are That would be super annoying. Let's also build this guy down here. Same kind of deal. Blocking objects, but not so much right there. Beautiful. Okay, now, uh, that should be everything except for, of course, this one down here. Now, as far as this goes, Sector scan. this guy is alive. I didn't install the mod, unfortunately, between episodes uh, to get the explorer doing the manual exploring. Can we come over here and actually rescue this little buddy? <clears throat> I forgot what I was doing for research. Oh, we're doing the deep metal, right? Yeah. Come on, friend. Join the crew. Do, 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 do. Nice. I think that guy's been out there for like a thousand years. Oh, he's actually... This unit has been destroyed. What? What the heck is that about? All right. Well, what was the point of that? Uh, let's come up here then and make sure we can build our defensive turret down there. I don't know if that'll happen. We need electronics at this thing right here. So we'll turn that on. Fantastic. And we also needed metals, but we already had that. Let's swing down to this depot and make sure it too has the electronics on. Not even sure. Yeah, there we go. Okay, electronics on down there. Hopefully the flyer guys fly the stuff out there for us. And I think that's it. Hopefully, okay, this guy's already up and at him. Fantastic. Defensive turret. Doesn't seem like I need to do anything to it. It's just functional. I don't know if they're going to start shooting or what. This guy up and at him over here. Yep. All right, well. We're ready and waiting, friends. However, there is a cold wave coming, and this is going to be a lot of power. So you know what I might need? I, I'm just going to have to open these things. That's all there is to it. I mean, once I open these, whoo, hoo, hoo, that's going to be crazy. Malfunctioning a Cablies. What? Why do I even have a Cablie out there? What a stupid place. Delete. All right, no more problem. No resources. Okay, great. Did I finish scanning every single sector? I did not, but as of right now, yes. Every single thing is deep scanned in just a few seconds. All right, so as far as anomalies go, looks like... What do we got? We got one, Sector's two... Scanned. Three, four, five, and even six. All right, let's go. Let's go get them then. Look at all these guys. One, two, three of them down there. They want to come at me. They want to. But you know what? We're ready and waiting. We got one turret, two turrets, three turrets. Whole base under protection. Four turrets. Amazing. Doesn't freeze. Also, I didn't even think to check for that. But wouldn't you know? Working just fine and dandy. This cable is many or malfunctioning up there. I suppose I can come deal with that a little bit. Also, I'm kind of wondering, like, where does the frozen begin and end? Like, I can't really see. I wonder if this... Because I'm wondering if this is not frozen right there. It very well might not be. I also wonder if over here is not frozen. Let me find out if I try to put in a... Concrete extractor. What on earth? What kind of moron does that? Sector no. Scan. Water extractor. Cold terrain. Requires a deposit. This doesn't... Cold terrain. Cold terrain. Cold terrain, cold terrain requires a deposit. This does not say cold terrain. You guys notice that? Wait. Down here does, up there does, right here actually does. Okay, never mind. It just doesn't, it's just not that accurate with it. It's all cold terrain. How about over here? I'm just curious, it requires a deposit. All right. Well, if I go to build something, 
and I'm Jamie. Too far from domes. Water tower. Does it tell me if it's a cold terrain? Nope. Mm, That's strange. So true. I mean, throughout our lives, we work hard Breakthrough discovered. Hive mind. When we Residents in the arcology get a bonus to work performance based on the number of unique perks and specializations of colonists living in the arcology. Wow. That could actually be crazy if you think about it. Am I ready for the opportunity to hear the next song? Uh, that guy's such a doofus. This guy all right? Yeah, I think. Did I just send him off? No, he's going to do. Oh wait, no, that's an enemy. That's an enemy thing there. Are we gonna be okay? Or is he gonna blow up my rover? I have no clue. Does this thing need maintenance? Maybe. I mean, we're ready to go. The first all... attack is on its way. Yeah. Brace Bring yourselves. it, friends. All stations, red alert. This moment's been coming for a long time. Has it? Has it really? Are they falling from the sky again? Or not that I can see. No. Uh, I don't see him up here either, so... Whoa! Holy mother of rockets! What? Rockets Red Glare! Yes! Bring it! Bring it, little vehicles! Woo! Getting wrecked! Getting wrecked! Holy, what a terrible military, that doofus! <laughs> yep! <laughs> wow! Wow, 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 wow. Where is this guy even firing? He's firing into the sky, I think. Look at this guy shooting up over here. He's coming at us, but we're definitely taking... He's at half health already now, too. Holy... See, this game could be amazing if there were wars. If you had multiplayer, you can fight other people. Oh, my RTS. I would love an RTS of this. It would be so much fun. Like, literally, this game, but it's like a 15-hour battle against somebody. That would be super, super awesome. Wow. All right, uh, let's zoom over here. How we doing? These guys are driving over, it looks like. Yeah, we're, we're just wrecking everything. Anything over there? Nope. I saw some guys flying over at some point, but I think we're... Oh, hey, we got some stuff down here. Yep, they're coming at us. I don't even know what they're doing. They're just driving around, dying. Look at this. Look at those missiles. They go way the heck up there to come back down behind it. Well, that guy's dead. Can I go claim him or whatever? Destroy this rover, really? 20 metals and 10 electronics. Wow. Okay. Here's another one. Destroy. Okay. That's insane. How's my guy down here? Can we go ex Oh my god, another thing's blowing up down there. Let's go scan another anomaly way the heck out there. That one's really far. Well. This, uh, can these guys even shoot me? Because so far I haven't seen them do anything but blow up. Woo! Look at this one. He just delivered us a ton of free loot. Thanks, friends. Thank you very much. One medals was stolen from Genesis 2. That's unfortunate. Oh, wow. Look at him just running. He's just running away. He's like, ah! I mean, they are just remote-controlled vehicles, right? So... I can't believe the range these things have. Look how far we can shoot them. For Like, we're shooting them. Our defensive structure was here. We can shoot twice as far against vehicles. Drones without controller, five. Oh! Oh! This unit has been destroyed! Somehow they killed my rover! How the heck? Oh, this guy over here must have shot my rover and destroyed it. They got two of them out there. Wow. Wasn't expecting that. All right. Not that I really needed that thing anyway, but I mean, we got all these like little droney monies here doing nothing. Let's go assign them up uh, maybe over here. Now, That this actually reminds me, I think several episodes ago, depleted deposits. Really? Already? That was fast. Let's get that guy out of there. While I'm thinking about it and while I'm over here, let's go for... Concrete exo is that, is that what it's called? An exo uh, Looks like 114 right there. I know it's not called an exo -stractor. Whoever the heck immediately started typing a comment. Calm down. All right, this is all set. Good to go. And, wow, I actually did lose one thing. But this guy here is ripped apart. Salvage. Beautiful. Do they even have any more at this point? Well, they got some out here. Yeah, they actually have a whole bunch on the map still. A lot of them. Wow, they got a lot down there. I thought about pulling back, too, but I didn't. What are you going to do, right? Look at my little drones. Boo! 
Okay, this guy is destroyed. Rip him apart. This guy over here, destroyed. Rip him apart. Beautiful. Wow. Just random metals all over the place. Apparently, they become mine once they get destroyed. So where is everybody? We got one out here, one way out there, one over there, one over here, one right there. Oh, the cold wave. I forgot about that. Negative 200 power. All right. So... That's a bit much. Let's come in here and be like, yo, everybody open. Behold the glorious look at this screenshot. Behold. <sighs> That's amazing. Every one of them opened. <laughs> oh, look at it turn on, dude, just as the solar panels go away for the night. Wow. Yep, so much for that cold wave being a problem. We went from negative 200 to positive 89, even after the solar panels shut down. Okay. Well, my defensive turrets seem to have worked pretty good. I'm not sure. Wow, 22 power. I don't feel like I really need to leave these on anymore, so let's shut that guy off. Oh, he's going to freeze if I shut him off, though. Maybe not, because who cares? I got plenty of power. Uh, malfunctioning cable. Way the heck out there, really? Is this thing... That's not even something I care about. Like... Let's get out of here. Let's come over here to salvage. And just get rid of that cable. That thing's been dead. It's been dead to me forever. Remaining six more days on the cold wave. All right, that's fine. Drones with no controller, too. Let's grab those guys and just reassign them back down to this guy over here, to this drone drone friends at full capacity. I didn't realize they had a full capacity. Okay. Well, in that case, we'll reassign them back up here to our command center. Beautiful. Lots of buildings are not work. Oh, I forgot to turn on my heater. And luckily, it still has uh, the, the capacity here to not be frozen. Building has malfunctions. Drones can repair it. It's on high priority. Not sure why it malfunctioned exactly, but just completely forgot about that. So I suppose now that I have meteor defense systems, it would make sense for me to group up all... The only reason I spread it out is to defend against meteors crushing everything, but if they're defended... It would be more logical to put everything in a tight, tight, tight-knit ball and then have a scrubber cleaning them all while simultaneously having uh, the heater keeping them alive. So, oh, by the way, I was checking this thing out here. Available drone prefabs 11. This thing, do I need more? I've got 92. How many? This is insane. Okay, we got 20 over there. I got my drone commanders at full capacity. This guy down here is now at 40. I think I'm over the top on the drones. I really do feel like that's the case. Can I turn this guy back on at this point? I suppose I could. Unload a bunch of things there, turn that on high capacity. This thing we no longer need. I've just built too many. The engineers aren't doing anything. We're just wasting power. Not that it even matters. All right. Um, I was speaking of, let's land in here for my other evaporators. And I think we're pretty much good. Just a matter of waiting for these guys to get uh, aggressive with me. I wish I had seen them shoot back. That would have been cool. Oh, wow. This guy's... Oh, that guy's going to get frozen out there because the... the... Uh, the cold. Definitely cold. Well, we're going to have to go rescue him, I suppose. Vector pump. What the heck is that? Moisture evaporator upgrade water? What? No way! That makes everything a thousand. What did I also get over here? Residents in the arcology, right? That's for six thousand. This is nine thousand. Water production increased by one hundred. That's like ten more water for f literally free. I'm tempted to do it before deep metals extraction, but I don't need either metals. I don't need anything. Like we are good, hundred percent good. All right. Well, I suppose we just play, and these guys screw around forever is my guess. I'm really doubting that they can even come over here and kill me. So my thinking is I don't need these defensive turrets at all. Ooh, buildings with no ex deposits. That guy got wrecked. All right, take him out of there. Take this out of there. Beautiful. We're gonna have to expand this over here. Maybe build a drone hub over here wouldn't be a bad idea, thinking about it now. And then we can also cover that water. How much is left in this concrete? 321? Yes. All right. Well, maybe we do. If we do build a drone hub, we want to probably put it somewhere like here, in which case. I can't even see what's going on. It's like, what is happening? It's nighttime, misty. 
This poor guy died halfway out. No surprises there. My RC transport? I'm not even sure, like... Oh, he seems to be transporting. I guess this guy came to kill me. And wouldn't you know, we blew him up. So there goes one more of them. What is my transport doing? Okay, let's turn auto gather off for a minute here. There he is. Okay, let's turn auto gather on. The invasion was unrelenting. Our only choice was to fight to survive or fall to the tide of violence. ESOCorp just sent a whole bunch of rovers. They're quick to enter formation for a second attack. Hostilities will resume any minute now. Oh god, did I turn off my things? Too far from a working drone, I realized that I think I might have turned these off. No, I didn't. I talked about it, but then I didn't. Let's make sure they're all on high priority. Good, 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 good. Malfunctioning pipes, that'll get taken care of. Malfunctioning cables, that'll get taken care of. We'll be fine. I just need to make sure my little transport here, wherever the heck he went. I don't know where he went. Should I launch my rocket? I suppose I should. Off we go. I brought some moisture evaporators. I don't even need them, but now I've got them. I want to go off, and I want to come back with... Uh, I don't even know what I want right now, to be honest. There was something in my mind two seconds ago. Four more days on this cold wave. This guy's going to need maintenance eventually, but doesn't need maintenance. Now. Where the heck is my... He, he's just stuck. He's just he's just stuck. I don't understand what's going on. Let's just bring him up here for a bit and have him defend. I don't want him to get him melted or anything like that. What the... What the... What is... Oh! Are we shooting at them in the sky? Whoa! Look how many they have! My name is Jamie. Did they destroy this guy? They did! They destroyed my rover! I have no more drone rovers. That's what I wanted to go pick up, by the way. Why is this guy... Oh, they destroyed my defensive turrets. Really? I totally did not anticipate that. Now they're coming through my tunnel up here, but we've got another defensive turret. Let's see how this works. Oh boy, what are we shooting at? Okay, we're shooting at him right there. Okay, what's happening over here? I'm hearing some explosions, like... This guy's coming in, it looks like. I'm hearing some explosions. Some Live spl by the sword. Die by the sword. Or the weaponized rover. Same difference. The ESOCorp rovers we destroy can be repaired and used against the enemy. Or salvaged for resources. What's more, they can protect anything in their range against meteors. What? That's amazing. I didn't know that. Where am I shooting right now? I don't even know. Did they destroy my transport? Yeah, they destroyed my transport. Oh, they destroyed everything. Can I repair the transport? Salvage. How do I repair their things? This unit has been destroyed. Salvage for materials. I could have sworn... Okay, here's one right there. Ah. Send drones to this... Now we can repair them. Amazing. Amazing. Okay, let's let's go capture one and see what happens. Down here, I want to see... Okay, we took care of that one as well. We don't have any drones, and we don't have any ability to get any drones down there either. Wow. Okay. Is there more over here? Nope. Ooh, here comes another one. He's getting wrecked. Ooh, look, we've got one now. Thanks for the enemy. That's insane. Reloading. Look at him. Boo, boo, boo. That's incredible. Now I have anti-meteorite roving defense things? You gotta be kidding me. How the heck? I can't send drones out there to get that guy up, but... All right. Where the heck are the rest of them? Ooh, you know what? Where is Where the heck are mine is a better question. Because they're not at the front of the list and these are all blue? There are tons of them on the list. Okay, here's the one I can capture. I wish I didn't rip all those other ones apart then. Ooh, here, here's my guy. Ah, he's this one right there. So yeah, it still looks blue to me even though it's really not supposed to be. Let's get this guy down here to defend because this turret's going to get overwhelmed. Okay, or not. Ooh, that's awesome. Look at that. It's incredible. Did this guy just shoot at me? It did. He just shot at me. He's oh, do you guys see that? He just blew up my defensive turret. Back in the day when all we 
This is a right and proper battle ward here. Whoa! My lord, what's happening? All right, uh, let's, let's fall back to the defensive structure, friends. Let them come to me at this point. We've lost our outer perimeters for sure. They're done. They're done for. Meteor shower. Oh, no. Oh, who cares? I've got defenses. I have got defenses for days. These guys are going to need maintenance at some point, but I'm not even sure really how much. Whoa, here's another one. He must have come through. Wait, experimental. His vehicle has been destroyed. Salvage for materials. Why can't I... I guess you can only reclaim them. Uh... As you know, I always encourage you guys to drop me away. If it happened after that notice or whatever. Ooh, look at the drones go over there and rip that guy apart. Grocer destroyed. Would you rebels stop rebelling? Alright, drones without controller. Yeah, I realize there's a ton of them. These guys, however, they'll be fine. They won't freeze to death. Because the cold wave should be over in three days. Well, they might freeze to death. Let's reassign them then up here. Just so they don't get uh, completely destroyed. Now, where the heck's the rest of my rovers? I have no idea. What is this down here now? Oh, it froze? Mm, yeah. May as well shut it off then. Just forgot about it. Did this thing not turn on? No, it didn't turn on and it froze. So nothing here is working. You know what? I don't even really want to turn this off. I'll just leave it on. You guys, whatever. Just do whatever you want to do. It's fine by me. All right, let's go through these guys one by one. So we got one out there. He seems to be coming towards us. One over here. One down there we've destroyed. One over there at 80. They're going to run out of batteries at some point. This guy actually died. Oh, where is this? Let's watch the defensive systems engage. See it, Meteor. Let's see it. Oh, there he is. Uh, hello? Do, they, do, those, do those defensive things not do defenses? Where is my defensive thing, by the way? We got one right here. Defensive turret. Guys. We have a water shortage. Really? What the? A laser targeting defensive structure protects nearby buildings from meteors. Oh, look at this. It was one meteor, meter outside of the meteor. That one, however, was in the range. Oh, but this one's destroyed. Oh, well, that was also not within the range. I guess that meteor just picked, like, the perfect place to drop to actually do a ton of damage over here. This building has malfunctions. Drones can repair it. Yeah, well... That's that's it didn't actually destroy anything, it just did did some maintenance there. Domes without water? What the hell is this now? Why are we short on water? Is it because we have three pipe leaks? One, two, three. Yes. Alright, they'll get taken care of. I can't do anything about the domes without water. It'll it'll get itself taken care of. Uh, over here we got this little guy. He can't move. This guy's flying overhead. That's fine. The building's destroyed. One, two, three. I'm amazed that they managed to take that one out. I never even saw that happen. Tons of malfunctioning cables as well. Just sucking the power, but we've got enough to not have to carry about it. Vehicles with low power. Yep, my rover died out there. Luckily, he's not getting destroyed by anybody. Uh, as far as these guys go, I don't even know where mine are. They're dead, like, all over the place. I thought I had two at least, but... Maybe I sent one down and they got blown up? I don't know. A water shortage. Domes without water, too. Yeah, I know. It's just the water leaks, guys. Just... Get, get it taken care of. Okay, here comes the, the drones. They're working on it. We got one, two right there. Whoa! Whoa! Somebody tried to come through that tunnel, and he did not have a good day. <laughs> Let's just put it that way. He didn't have a good day. Does that mean... Where even... Okay, there he is. Whoa! 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 What the heck? I guess there's another one here. Yoink! We'll take that. Fantastic. That might be my guy. I don't know. I want all my uh, things back here in like kind of a defensive wave. Ooh. <laughs> Thanks for the free defensive things, guys, that use no power and work infinitely, apparently. Oh, look at that. I think we just wrecked that guy, too. Yep, sure did. Wow. How do I even select all of these things? I'm not even. Can I select multiple ones? No. That's unfortunate. 
Hmm. All right. Well, we got one. This guy's. Oh, these guys are paws. Those are ours. Okay. So the ones with the pause button are definitely ours. So let's do this. Never mind. There's another one. Yoink. This is supposed to be very hard. This increased the difficulty 50%. Mind you. 50%. Okay, let's do this. Let's grab everybody who has a pause key, because those are going to be ours. We'll drive them down here. So that's one, two, three, four at the very least. I might have more. I felt like I did. Yeah, right there. Five. No functioning pipes. Apartments destroyed, guys. Come on now. You're getting a little overboard here. I've got full security. Maybe that doesn't affect that one. How many rebels do I have? I'm actually scared to look. This is Serenity 1. No, I want to go to the entire colony. 45 rebels? <gasps> you know what else I don't have is kids. Hopefully people aren't too old. Let's go take a look up here. 167 middle-aged. Nope, not so much. Well, it may be time. How many... We, we do actually have some spaces, I think, for... Do we? Vacant residential slots, zero. Vacant nursery slots, 32. Homeless, four. I think if we started having kids now, we would be good to, to populate. So, how do I even do this? I'm so confused right now. I gotta make sure I don't die from forgetting to populate the planet. That would be terrible. Domes. Let's put the big... It doesn't really matter which dome has kids. I don't think because they all go to the same place. So Serenity number one, we'll turn that on. How did I get 45 rebels? I suppose it's something worth looking into. But I mean, look at this. Sanity is green across the board. Morale, green across the board. Health, totally perfect, except for like one guy for whatever reason. So it seems like the only issue then is comfort. And we got a couple of people with low morale. And it's probably because what's happening is people are working out and outside or whatever and they're going crazy, but we can fix that we with just a, a couple of resources. Oh my lord, what now, guys? What now? Malfunctioning pipes. Why is there a pipe over there? Oh, there's a pipe down there that's dead? Okay, here's my solution to that. Buy pipe. Okay, fixed. <laughs> yes, thanks, Dust Storm. You really, you tried hard. Now, let's see where the rest of these enemies are. So we got one right up there in front of us. That's the only one remaining. That's actually literally the only one remaining. All the rest of them are dead or ours. Okay. Well, here we go. Second wave. Second wave is ours to lose. The Rover Brigade. Oh, God. Go over there. It sucks that I have to pause. This is like literally old Dune 2 style. Like you have to we click have every unit shortage. individually. I am so sick of the waters. Just fix it. Fix the water! Where, where's the pipes? The pipes over there? Another pipe over here? Good lord. Alright. Boom. There. No more pipe leak, guys. No more pipe leak. Fixed. <laughs> Rover, what are you doing? You're supposed to be in- Oh, there we go. Isocorp is done. Hmm. Rovers, either smoldering piles of scrap, or under our total control. Total control. An attack? From Earth. Never thought we'd see the day. Has this. That is like six for six. Like. I can see you are tired from your heavy physical work. Come with us. Come to Mars. The efforts are low and the wages are high. What do you say? You know. Uncle Mars wants to oh my god. It's like... <laughs> okay, can we get back into the music, please? <laughs> nope! An attack from Earth. Never thought we'd see the day. Has this caused a rift between our two worlds? Wounds are too fresh to tell how deep they go. Might we have a chance? We can walk them off and move forward together. Too early to tell, really. Back on Earth, ESOCorp executives have been arrested and the company has been shut down in many major nations. This will certainly cause economic upheaval. But the ruling parties have deemed it necessary to send a message for all future warlords. Space is neither up for military conquest nor a test ground for weapons. 
Developing space-oriented water machines still remains against the rules. <laughs> and we will continue to pretend that this was just the fluke. Humanity has shed its need for a war with grace. Looking at the smoking battlefield so far from Earth, we can't help but wonder if this is indeed the case. This, however, brings us to our next question. Do we destroy the prototype weapons made for the Martian environment and salvage what resources we can from the rovers, or do we keep the technology in anticipation of another fluke? Gained new technology, Project Moholy. Put 6EZ-3 on display, destroy the rest, or we would be fools to be caught so defenseless once again. Well, I don't really need these guys, honestly. I'm just gonna put them on display and display the rest. I mean, it's fine by me. Boom! Whistleblower achievement unlocked. They all just disappeared. Did I at least get the resources for them? I have no idea. I should have salvaged them all when I had the opportunity then. Malfunctioning pipes. All right, we should be taking care of that. So what happened? History of events. Mars Gate affair has ended as all ESO Corpus have been arrested. Is that, is that it? Is it over? Or like, what happens now? Did I win? Is the game over? Have we survived Mars? I don't know. I gotta get rid of 7,000 issues on my screen, I suppose. Cold Wave's done in 18 hours. So once that's gone, we can probably uh, return to normal here. Let's just speed up. Shuttle heavy load. No fuel for shuttles. Why don't we have fuel for shuttles? I got like 10, literally 548 fuel, zero fuel, insufficient fuel. All right, well, this fuel here, this fuel there. Are you guys, there's low load. They seem to be busy out of their minds. Is it frozen? No, I don't, I don't know what the hell to tell you guys. Like it's right there. There we go. I guess they got fuel. All right. Uh, now we lost our transport and we lost our Oh wait, we still have one rover. No, we don't. It's actually destroyed. All right, well, I guess we'll just rip it apart then. So we need a new rover, or I could build one, or I need a transport, uh, if I can afford them. Let's go see. Cargo rocket. Rover's probably the more important thing. The transport, yeah, I can get one of those later, I suppose. Let's launch. Good enough. As long as I get the rover, we're in business. Sucks that I lost my, uh... I guess the transport doesn't matter too much, but... Oh, this guy went on some maintenance needs there. We're down to 34 polymers. Did all these get maintenanced? I have no idea. Let's just keep going here. Malfunctioning cables. Does that meteor storm starts in nine hours? Guess who's going to be ready for that one? Also, cold wave ends in 11 hours. Plenty of water. Plenty of air. Plenty of electricity. Fuel apparently got put in over here. That's great. These guys are flying around. We're just working on, like, getting the metals extractor going. Meteor incoming. Oh, a shooting star. I think it showed up and I destroyed it instantly. I didn't even get to see it. I'm pretty sure that's what happened, though. I got an achievement called shooting star, so. All right. We even have meteor defense. That, that, that event actually made the colony stronger. One hour on this ridiculous cold wave. And it's uh, done. All right, let's grab all you guys and close you all up. Boom. We're good on that front. 71 power. Everything's clean. Everything's good. We just need to maintain and repair everything. Fantastic. These guys are back to working now like they should be. Rare metals extractor. I could upgrade it, but what's the point, really? It's very low quality, I suppose. Maybe that's the point. I don't know. What does it take to do it? I uh, need to use fuel on it. Well, I do have a ton of fuel, but I don't really need rare metals, so probably fine. Vehicles with low power. Right. That guy got wrecked out there. My RC transport, by the way, is destroyed. We're going to have to salvage him up. So sad. I can do the technologies to uh, get places with this. One thing I should probably be concerned with is the number of renegades I have, because it's pretty ridiculous. However... I'm not even sure how they're becoming renegades. Let's go check Leo Martin, right? He, he's not having the best of lives here. What's the problem? Service building was full. Dining, dining, dining. Had an unprepared meal. Negative three, negative three, negative three. Okay, so that's his problem. Can I just sort? No, I can't sort the stats. He's the only one. Spirit Martian Polymer Factory. Let's go check out her sanity. It's too cold. Worked outside the dome. It's too cold. Dehydrated. It's too cold. We can fix that with a couple of... Uh, 
with a couple technologies. I'm not even sure, like, Ray or Ryan. You're a renegade. Why are you a renegade? Well, can we look down here? No. No available sir. Dining, shopping, dining. All right, I guess the problem is we don't have enough places for people to go to do stuff. We definitely don't need this many kiddo things. Let's rip out one of these schools. I guess people really want to dine. Oh, wait a minute. I don't need to rip out a school. Never mind. Let's actually cancel that. And let's grab uh, these nurseries we're not even using. Let's put another diner in there. I probably should have been paying it more attention. I wish they gave you like little pop-ups. Like other games seem to do that a lot better. Like, they just it's easier to, easier to track like what's going on and what you need to do rather than just like all of a sudden you notice you got nine million people who are angry at you, and you can't fix that anyhow. All right, so that's the dining. You know what else I could do is build all those art thingies that I never got around to doing? I could put them, like, really anywhere. I kind of wanted to put all that stuff in here, though. Looking at it, I suppose I could. I'm probably going to move the nurseries to the next... Nah, because the schools are all in here already, so... Then again, the nurseries are in here as well. I'm going to have to rip out one of the... I could rip the di... No, you need the, the diner there in the future. Well... Uh, what should I do? I'm just gonna rip out both. Okay, we got one nursery there, one here, one there. Let's grab the one is probably... Is it sufficient? Not really. I really don't think I'm gonna need two schools. Let's get rid of this school because that one looks kind of cool. This is our original school. Oh, speaking of, enthused, composed, workaholic. I never even did this. Enthused, composed, workaholic. They were all being trained in like the wrong stuff. Enthused, composed, Workaholic, yeah. Beautiful. Once this thing's out of here now, let's get that out. Beautiful. That's finally put in at I long, long last. The elect- Ooh, look, little Pater Inc, guys. We'll put one of those guys in. We'll put an art store in here as well. You know, let's put the art store back here. You kind of got to go through, like, the pathway down by the statue, down by the road to get into the art store. Beautiful. We found another anomaly. Oh, nice. That's actually pretty cool. Meteor storm for one day. Building's not working for. Yeah, I know. Not mu nothing much I can do about that right now. Science, 84% on that deep metals extractor. Bump, 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 bump. All right, let's take another look here at the colonists. Anyone else super angry? Andromeda Dust Devil. Well, she was low on comfort, but she's looking... I could, I could do a bunch of comfort things. Whew. There's actually a lot of... At Atlas Rigel, what's your problem? No available gambling, no drinking. Okay, we have drinking right there. So, I guess people just need more stuff and we never got around to making it. I think the gambling is a full square and I can't really fit that. So, nice. Now we got a place for people to at least go do their electronics. Put that on high. Put this on high. Do their art as well. That got completely stored up. So, at least they can f fill a couple of their needs. Casino complex seems like the next most interesting thing. However... No real good place to put it. I'm going to have to build another dome. You know what to say about that. If you're going to build a dome, you build a mega dome. Shouldn't really need to do that, but... I should, maybe I should do like a little offshoot side dome right there for all the houses. No, because then they have to work in different domes. I don't know. Maybe all the kids go over there? I don't know. University? No, because then they, they train slower. I, don't, I really don't know the most optimal setup. I don't really want to know it, though, because I'm sure there's one... Whoa! Maholy Mine?! Mining deep into the crust of Mars, the Maholi Mine produces metals, rare metals, and waste rock. While heating the surrounding area. 400 concrete, 100 metals, 300 machine parts. We actually have all of that except the concrete. Base production, 50 metals and 20... What? It also heats the... What? Right here, right here would be perfect for that. I'd have to bulldoze my thing there or move my uh, refinery. Yeah, I'd have to move, I'd have to move that fuel depot. Oh, we can do that. We're just gonna need more concrete. Unfortunately, until I get a rover here, we can't get our concrete. We do have a million concrete there, but how much more do I have out there? Only 84. Then we're going to have... How much is more left here? 200. We're going to have to do a little offshoot down there. Build a drone hub down there as well, I feel. Really get that thing taken care of. Okay. Okay. Let me think about this for a second. Let's actually make this happen right now. Depot. 
fuel depot. Let's put the fuel... I don't know, the thing that storms like to come through this area. So let's put the fuel maybe like somewhere more safe. I don't, I hell if I know where that is. Maybe like down over there. Okay, looks good. Then this one here, we're going to rip that out. Beautiful. How many more things do we have to rip out of this one? 200. Oh, my uh, rocket has landed. Fantastic. Nice. We got our little rover dover. Let's grab uh, as many of these drones as possible and fill that guy up. He can get only a total of eight. Let's swing down here now. Oh, no, actually, let's come over here and have him come heal him up first. Then we'll go over to the right. Buildings destroyed too from the hostile attack. Yeah. I probably don't need these things on like ever. I guess we can repair it and then turn it off. Or just turn it off. Can you feel it? Of course you can. Music is the repair off. Where language fails, music Unless there's an actual meteor storm. They're basically not doing anything. Let's turn them all off. Do you remember your child? Okay, this guy's ready to go. Back to Earth one more time. He's got one drone. That's fine. Deep Metals Extraction. Now that I finally unlocked it, I've got the stupid Mahole Mine, and I don't even need it. Oh. Oh. Rare Metals, Metals, Concrete. Oh, do I just build a Metals Extractor on it? Is that how it works? I assume there was a special deep metals mine for it, but doesn't actually look like it. Yeah, now they just look like regular deep metals. Deep underground deposit can be exploited by a metals extractor. Yeah, it's just a regular metals extractor. Well, we have this one over here, and that one's actually still good for 113 more. Then we can delete that one, put that one over here. This is going to go from 113 very low to 2,200 average. I want to get this mine done before the episode's over. Let's get my explorer... And let's come back here and charge up. Get my drone back here to charge up as well. Let's go look at how many anomalies we have yet to scan. They're all done over there. They're all done up here. We get one science down there for probably a thousand. And then we got four more breakthroughs we can research at our leisure. Let's go do that science one, shall we? Oh, speaking of, what am I even researching for science? Martian-born... Ooh... Interplanetary astronomy gives access to new breakthrough technologies and boosts overall research. Moisture evaporate upgrade 100% more water. We'd never need water again. Especially if I build some big water. There's so many things. We have almost all of them. What is this? Oh, Mahole Mine. I see we get the free research. That basically just gave us 20,000, it looks like. Wow. Martian-born strength. Let's, let's worry about getting the colonists happy, actually. Let's do the comfort things from 100 years ago. Residences have improved comfort. Let's do that. Uh, and then there's another one here. Farms increase the comfort as well. Uh, let's do actually this one first, though. That'll be done in like half a day or whatever it's going to take. I don't know. Okay, is this guy charged up yet? No. This guy's moving off to go do work. Do we need to do any work down here? Not particularly. Let's swing down here instead because this is where we need to be to get all this taken care of. Another thing we're going to need to do very soon is build a drone hub. Let's figure out where I'm going to want to put it. Well, probably... Here is beautiful. Let's do that. Start getting our uh, power cables run to this. It's kind of an awkward situation here. I think we can just go straight like this. No, not really, but we can do it like that over and over. Anomaly beautiful. Analyzed. I think. Actually, no. Not beautiful. Let's delete that. And a drone hub right like such. Yeah, there we go. Now it's beautiful. Two food was stolen. We gained a thousand whatever. Explorer, you have so few things to explore. Come, come get this thing. Buildings destroyed. That thing and this thing. Yeah, I'm well aware of that. Concrete's back up and Adam here. I want to build that mine so badly. Oh, let's get these guys down here so we get this taken care of. That's going to be awesome. You know what I could also use here is a 155 electronics. Where are they all going? We probably need more drones. Let's turn the drone assembler on. One, two, three, four, five, ten billion, nine, eight, two, six. Looks like a decent amount for this new drone hub. I probably have too many as it is, like all over the place, but you never have too many drones. 
That's what I like to say. Now, this is just easy. Super easy. Discovered. Uh, can I, should I connect up? I'm not even sure how to, okay, let's do from there to here. Beautiful. We just got forever young. Seniors can work and have children. Well, that actually makes them a hell of a lot more useful. Awesome. Uh, we're almost done our comfort levels on the biome cedar. That's going to be good. Fun fact for you. Look at this. How much is this? 600 or 560 in high? Perfect. Perfect. No wonder karate is a great way to develop. Well, I... Whoa! I guess that was fine. If I get an impact for the meat, I had to pause really quick and turn on my building, but then I'll have to go maintenance, or turn the maintenance on, because it's going to be at 100% all the time, unless the scrubber bubbers are keeping it clean, which they are. Look at that. The thing's been turned off with zero maintenance. It goes up a little bit, but Research then it gets cleaned. Complete. Doesn't even matter. Grocer destroy... Would you freaking renegades... Renegades everywhere. Uh, let's do a bit of the old rebuild. I think the diner, we need more diner space if I remember correctly. I don't even know what we're doing at this point. I need a gambling space. Dome, bioscaping, residences have improved comfort. That's fantastic. Let's throw in a new thing here. Medical center? We can, oh, and that's increased birth rate. There was one that gives people relaxation, but I'm not too concerned with that. When I do more, nah, this is pretty cheap though. 4,500, that's like two days. Oh, how about this one down here? It's also 4,500. Security officers are, are more adept. Are more adept. That sounds like a good idea to me. Wow. Look at the base, friends. Look at the base. It might be time for a mega dome. Or that 400 concrete has got to get done. As much as this rare metals extractor is a lot of fun, it's time. It's time. Get it out of there. Over here, come to that, come to this, click on salvage, click on salvage, click on salvage, right? Why can't I salvage that? There we go, we got it. Let's get this guy out of here, blow it up, beautiful. Time for the Mahole Mine! Or it will be, as soon as they're done. Or will it, because it looks like we're actually... I gotta... Can I rotate it? Yes, rotate it over there. No, my water evaporator is like just in the way. Oh, well, no, now it's hitting the do Oh, I see. Yeah, we're, we're like one tile away in every direction from making this work. I can't build the water evaporators. So then again, I have a bunch, I think, already here with us that I'm not even using. Yeah, I do. I have two there. Well, this one's just going to have to get wrecked. It's just going to have to get wrecked. We'll replace it with another one from, let's say, I don't even know where. Where's my nearest scrubber bubbers? Down here, possibly. Yeah, that'll work. Perfect. All right. Funding received. Delete. This one got built instantly. Upgrade. Beautiful. Click on that. Click on this. Oh, look at that. Where do I want it to face? If pop right there. Does this produce a ton of dust? May block access to deposit. This building requires power. Boom. Boom friends. Boom. I am building wonders. Wonders. Where are all these malfunctioning cables? Oh, we have a ton of power just being wasted by this stuff. Should I bother fixing that? I don't know. I don't really need this guy over here anymore because the drone hub has that under control, so maybe. Let's just kind of swing up there. So the point I can just like shrug off any issues I have. Yeah, there's a ton of things up there that are broken. And I'm not really doing anything with these, so I'm just kind of wasting resources right now. Since I don't need them at all, let's do this. Let's go straight for a salvage. Yeah, I, I just don't see the need. It's going to cost more to maintain them when I don't need them. Well, that was, that was actually, uh, 
What the? This is actually really hard to click with this stuff. You gotta get like every little, every little thing. There. All right, all taken care of. This guy's connected to that, which we actually want. So that's fine with this thing over. Why is this a split life support grid? Okay, that's because this stuff is out there. We don't even need this stuff out there, honestly. It's not even going to work. Let's just bulldoze it, bulldoze it. Beautiful. And then while I'm thinking about it, let's do a quick salvaging of that little drop right there. Beautiful. Delete and delete. Don't even need it. Malfunctioning pipes back over here. That'll get taken care of. Buildings destroyed. I could rebuild it, but not really a huge deal right now. This is kind of like a bridge a bridge guy, I suppose. Oh, apartments destroyed for the 400th time. Some, okay. At this point, it's more like micromanaging ruffians. I just want to see this. Wow, 300 machine parts. All 100 metals are already there. This is going to be cool. 400 concrete, we're working on that is, look at these drones. Come on, drones, you got this. Put the mine right in like the best possible place. No fuel for shuttles. We've got fuel, we just don't have the time to unload it, apparently. Speaking of unloading it, uh, let's swing down here and say, yo, you probably don't have anywhere near 10 million drones. That's my guess. Now you get 17, enjoy. Way more than they need, that's for sure. How's this doing? We're still working on four of them. I just want to build my first wonder. Look at the, that's what a safe way. What a safe way to stack stuff up for sure. Just straight to the moon, guys. Straight to the moon. <laughs> wow. I don't want to take my cursor off of this thing until it's done building it. We got two more to go. Research complete. Emergency training. Security officers are plus 10. Medics are also plus 10. That's a good thing. We've unlocked everything here. We could unlock literally everything if I just try. I could probably do need some depots soon. Big water tanks would make things a little bit easier on that front. It's only 2,700. Let's throw that in. Ooh. Farm, hydroponic farm, and fungal farm upgrade. Automation decreases number of workers. Wow. We're going to have nobody doing anything for a long time, it seems. A very long time. All right. Well, whatever. And then I kind of want to do this increase uh, comfort from farms, but mostly just to unlock these last two things. I would like to end the episode, potentially the series, by just unlocking all of the technologies, building a wonder, and having a good time. By the way, 300 machine parts in this mine, and I still have 117 extra. I guess it's a good thing I built those 9 million machine parts I didn't need, huh? I don't even know what to do. I've got full fuel over there, full fuel over here. I don't even think I have places to store all this fuel, to be honest. If I go click on it, yeah, these fuel extractors are almost full. I also could, like, reorganize everything and make it a, a lot more efficient by keeping it um, safe from heat. By the way, Electro this thing, subsurface heater's on. It doesn't... Oh, no! It's approaching in three days, though. Uh, yeah, if I put everything in a really tight-knit thing and then I had just one scrubber, but again, I got millions of a power, so... Speaking of millions of power, do I have enough power is the question. Answer, what the... Of course I don't. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The ultimate dome, friends. The, we actually have the resources to make this, too, which is insane. It's absolutely insane. Now it's just a matter of getting 400 concrete with these little, uh, these guys, which is going to take a long time. Building destroy. Oh, that's actually done. All right, get it out of there then. Get it on up out of there. I, I like how much time I spent researching all this. Let's let's delete all this uh, random tubey woobies. Beautiful. Get you out of there now too. Oh, I have an explorer down there. I didn't even I completely forgot about him. Let's move him over here. He must have explored something a while ago. Yeah, anomaly by the breakthrough down there. We still have like three more breakthroughs we can go find. In fact. They're all down here now, so you know what? Let's go charge up down there, shall we? Anomaly found. Nice. Another free thousand science if I take the time to go out and, and grab it. <sighs> Let's put the apartments up a little bit higher. Oh, the concrete. We probably have a lot of homeless people right now as a result of this. By the way, 
I'm guessing my kids are out of control again. Yeah, of course they are. You, you, you let kids happen for like five seconds, and it's like, boom, kids are happening. Okay, domes. There we go. Perfect. Get that up. I have no idea how many renegades Research I have. Complete. Probably 10 million. Mega storage. Large water tank. Awesome. I want to go take a look at that. But first, what did we unlock? Nothing. I thought we would unlock the last thing on the list there, but apparently not. Interplanetary astronomy? Oh, no. We unlocked this, I think. I'm not even sure. What even is this thing? Oh, no. We saw that before. It gives access to new breakthrough technologies. Wow. Lowers the amount of workers needed in factories. I have no idea. You know what? Um, factory automation, just for the sake of getting something done. Or, no. I did say I wanted to fix all these things here. So let's do something in this line. Let's do this comfort from farms. Okay, two days until the dust storm. Will I be able to get 245 concrete up here? I don't think so. Maybe I should be researching the shuttles, actually. There are 9,000, though. Shuttle speed increased by 33. The one that... This one's 18,000, but that one will really help. But it's going to take forever to get that done. Uh, what I need to do is build a mega dome, which I was talking about before. Then I could build, like, another... Uh, Hawking's Institute, that would be really the ideal solution. Like, bulldoze this little thing here, build another Hawking's Institute someplace in here. I'm not sure exactly where. Oh, by the way, since we have all the kiddos here, let's turn the schools on, right? Just forgot about it completely. Oh, there's my apartment. That thing got put together fast. Radio on 106.7 FM. I'm Jamie Holland, providing you a fitting soundtrack for that fabulous life you're living. Hey, if I have 240 power, do I even need solar panels anymore? Can I do like control? No, you can't salvage them all at once. Oh, there's no sense in me doing this because these are just wasting my metals right here. There's just there no there's no funk. I know the the heater or whatever gives them like light at night, but there's just no sense in me caring about it. Really annoying you to do it all one one at a time, though. No control click on that one. 17 more hours. Is there a hotkey for this? Nope, there's not. Okay, control, activate. Activate for all large solar panels. All right, there we go. You can at least destroy them like that. You just can't shut them down like that. Awesome. Probably do the same deal over here now. I think we're good. How many of these guys do I even have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 30... 35. That's 350 power just from them. Power demand, 300. Okay. Well, there we go. Bye, Dome. You served us so well. You were there from the very beginning. By the way, this thing is now destroyed as well. Oh, is it now? Well, here's a good opportunity to see if I can't get this defensive turret repaired before this thing cracks in here. Probably not, is my guess. Maybe. Probably not. Nope. Oh, wow, that missed by a mile. All right. Oh, I did actually get the defensive turret up and at him. I suppose I can just leave all the turrets on, to be honest. Like, let's turn all of them off, on. on. I mean, unless I run out of power here. Dust storm starts in two hours. How long until this is done? 236. All right. Unfortunately, this is not going to get done this episode because the shuttles are going to be grounded and we're just not going to... It's just not going to get there, unfortunately. I might be able to if I had a transport, which I don't, by the way. I do have the ability to go buy one, though. I completely forgot about it. So let's go buy a transport. Beautiful. Anything else I want? Nope. I can build everything pretty much up the moisture evaporators. We got a million of them. We are a good and a launch. Well, I think I've defeated Mars, friends. I have destroyed all the rovers. Colony's good. Renegades are out of control. All I would have to do going forward is just uh, endless micromanagement, I think. I would just build a mega dome, research stuff, wait, like go through the dust storm, no problem, just be annoyed by it a little bit, research some more stuff. I really, the only, the only thing left is getting tons and tons and tons of research. It might even make sense to build a bunch of little tiny triangle domes, 
just to give them apartments with their own hawking institutes. And then we just train like a million people for research, plow through the tech tree like a madman. And that's the only thing I can really see to do here. Now, I know there's still more stuff in the list. 500 colonists, 1,000 colonists, construct a mega dome, construct a wonder. Well, we're almost done the wonder. The mega dome would not be difficult. It's only um, it's only 10,000 research, and we actually 300 concrete. Yeah, it's just going to be a matter of concrete. Concrete's really the number one issue right here. There's a little bit of concrete left down here. 200. That's very low though. This one's got 400 on high quality. We're going to have to build like a tunnel from here over to there, and then farm up all three of these things. Average, average, high, whatever. That's like 1500 right there. That's enough to probably build everything in the game with one more tunnel. Make it super quick. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I want to go through all of that. It would probably take like five episodes. No tension, no nothing. I think this is a success. I'm going to declare it a success. Wow. It was such a fun game. Although that event was kind of lame, honestly. Like a bunch of rovers show up, driving circles for no reason. Don't do anything. And then I just blow them up with like one, two turrets or whatever. Then I can steal them and use them against themselves. It was so easy. Did you know that karate actually means empty hand in Japanese? Anywho's, I think this is pretty good. Pretty good. No one's in the sanatorium. We have trained everyone of apparently all traits in the entire colony. I didn't do chronic condition though, and maybe there's more alcoholics now? Possibly? Maybe more lazies? Who knows? Who knows? Everything's taken care of except for the fact that I might have an entire colony full of renegades. So I got 181 colonists. I've got only 40 renegades, actually. That's not... It went down since the last time. And I'm pretty sure... We'd be getting less and less of those going forward because look at the colony right now. 100 health, 100 sanity, 100 comfort, 100 morale on like a bunch of people. Comfort's like the number one issue, but even that's gone up significantly. We're researching the farm thing to increase that even more. Uh, we could build like a gambling thing and that's like the last thing left. Maybe a couple workshops we could do in the next episode. Everyone would be absolutely fantastic. The Martian born stuff would mean they could go outside. They wouldn't care about dust storms or cold snaps or anything like that. We could research those really quickly as well. There, look at this. Every sanity is just everything. Super good. Just a handful of people with low comfort. Wow. All right. Well, yeah. What a fun game. I might, I might play the rest of it, but I don't want to talk or comment over it because it would take... Uh, it's just nothing's really going to happen. But we have survived Mars, friends. We have survived Mars. And I do recall in the very beginning of the game, it was really rough. Like, we were down... I was, like, waiting for rockets to land and dust storms to stop to get one single machine part, one electronic part. Now everything's just easy easy like stuff can be broken and i wouldn't even notice it's so it's so good my batteries haven't even been on by the way i've had every battery disabled for as long as i can remember when the windstorm comes it's not a problem because we're generating plenty of power once i get to the point where i can rip out all of my uh wind turbines no maintenance on those i can rip out all the solar panels i bet i could almost do that now i actually am pretty sure that i could at least rip out the solar panels not these guys I don't think yet. Maybe, though. I'm not sure. We have 551. That is so stupidly huge. Why do I have so much power? I don't know if I want to rip these guys out, though, because I upgraded most of them, so I don't know. But these never fail, and they never need maintenance. I could reduce the base to literally the size of, like, a little thing right here. Oh, one thing I'm just curious about is... How big are these water tanks? Large water tank. Maintenance... Whew! That's really big. Wow. It just has a large amount of water. Doesn't work during cold waves, but it would be, you know, it'd be fine. That's probably better. What was the maintenance on that? It's three metals. I don't know how much it stores. It just says large. But the other ones are using one metal. And if I have a scrubber on it, it might not even need any maintenance. So one of those could replace everything. And as long as it's heated with a missile defense station behind it, we're good. I can also now reappropriate these missile defense stations. I could probably pull the whole base together if I wanted to. Like, all this stuff on the right. I, I wouldn't want to rebuild all this, unfortunately. I could. 
put it like right there. We could literally have almost everything covered by a single missile defense. One single heater heating everything. No problem. That would actually be kind of cool to see, but yeah, I don't know. Whatever. Anywho, thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon. Oh, whoa, whoa, what the heck? I guess there's another one here. Yoink, we'll take that. Fantastic. That might be my guy. I don't know. I want all my uh, things back here in like kind of a like, defensive wave. Ooh. <laughs> Thanks for the free defensive things, guys.